Hey everyone, welcome back to episode 9 of the Demon Souls Walkthrough Lore Through series. So we got that key, we killed that guy. Um, now, we're going to go back and rescue Sage Freak, and then encounter the Black Phantom, and hopefully take on the boss. But I'm going to have to go farm um, in World 1-1 one, one, some grass, but now that we've got this unlocked, this is going to be nice shortcut basically now we can run back here find freak we can't rescue Lord R Ridiel yet we need the key from world 3-2 that's the next one but uh, let's do this now where Is it? I think I go up this way, right? I think. No, that's. That way to go to the boss. The freak is here. Yes. Yes. Magnificent. I never expected to get out of there alive. My name is Freik. I am known as a sage. I thought my magic would give me an edge against these demons, but how wrong I was. I have been enfeebled by my long imprisonment. But I can still move my legs. Yes, and I can go make back, it to the back Nexus. To the Nexus. I thank the stars that I escaped when I did. I owe you my life. Jerry's still up there. Yeah, I have been enfeebled, but I can still... Okay. Let's read the lore on some of the items we got. Shard of Mercury Stone. Melted poisonous ore. Enhances knives, curved swords, spears, and so on. An ore that applies strong poison to the weapon. Weapons can be strengthened by Mercury Stones up to a maximum level of 5. Shard of ore that reflects moonlight. Enhances straight swords, curved swords axes, hammers, and so on. Or that strong magical effect to the weapon. Weapons can be strengthened by moonlight storms up to a maximum of level 5. There's a chunk. Secret dagger. Half-bladed dagger, uh, wide use amongst the king's spies. Slashing weapon inflicts heavy damage on soft flesh, but has a limited effect on metal armor and hard skills. Daggers are effective after parrying as well as close range combat from behind. Uh, uh, rapiers have a narrow and long attack but have, deal heavy damage. They work well against metal armor, blah, blah, blah. Wither of the rapier can attack a shield raise. Yep, okay. It's just, uh, and then there's the two. We have got two escots. A Jerry Slow, here it is. An extremely small rapier, dagger sized and bladeless. It's imbued with special magic. It was made by Jerry, a friend of Sage Freak, the visionary who's known for his magical crafts. It steals a small amount of MP from its targets. Pretty cool, huh? I believe that's it. Oh, and then we got a kite shield, which is better than our buckler, actually. Good to go. To face the Black Phantom. And then the boss. This is going to be tough. Because <laughs> that Black Phantom is kind of difficult and annoying. But hopefully we'll do it. And we cannot rescue Radio that. <laughs> 
And if we didn't kill the NPC, he would keep reviving the boss. That's why he killed. Black Phantom should appear soon. It's an NPC, Black Phantom. Stop. Black Eye Stone, Chunk of Moonlight Stone, Stone of Ephemeral Eyes. Now, let's take some spice. Can't get hit a lot, but that's the boss. Hopefully we'll win. This is a cool boss. pillars. Up, we'll read that later.
fake. Real ones over there. The real one shoots the big, uh, soul arrow. Okay, that's fake, that's fake. She's real. How did they get me there? Oh no, she killed me. And... That's how you lose against her. <laughs> uh sucks. That sucks. I really uh, thought I could beat her. Um, I should have beat her, actually. I should have just used Flame Toss. That stinks. Oh, that's rough. I don't have any um, grass, though. So... Lost all our souls. This sucks. We're gonna have to fight our way back. Oh my gosh. It's a lot of souls we lost. Let's go to Boletarian Palace though. Farm a little bit of grass. It sucks. I should have beat her. That's incredibly upsetting, because she basically one-shot me as soon as you get caught in that. Uh, and I wasted time hitting the um, fake ones, but... That is annoying. Ugh, it's so annoying. She was 75%, I think, almost done. Drop some pressed bloom grass, sweet. Is this open? It's still not. Nothing. Okay. You guys aren't gonna drop anything? Buy some. Oh, gosh. Okay. I think I can actually, actually go and see if the dragons are gone and pick up the goodies from there. Nailbreaker. Um, you know what? Let's go do that. Why not, right? Let's explore in this episode. Gosh, I'm so upset I lost to her.
This is exactly everything I need. gesture. <laughs> Let's see if the other dragon's still there. Oh, they're both there. Sometimes they leave. Well, that stinks. I really thought I could. That's all right. I got nine crests. That it should be good enough. And I might buy some more. God, I'm really irked I lost to her. I played really sloppily. She's actually not a difficult boss, as you can see. Uh, but... Just really unfortunate what happened. Real unfortunate. Because now... I'm going to have to go back through that BS. Kill some of the octopus guys. Okay. Let's Hello again. I'm keeping deposit all these stones. We got the baby's nail. Forgot to get that. A dagger collated with the plague. The, uh, the blade is curved like a talon, often used by women and children for assassination amongst various unique weapons. This one's especially sinister. Let's put these back there. Keep the stiletto. Get rid of the scimitar now. Because we got... Silver places, elegant ornaments, most likely used to decorate equally outfit. Certain ordained by a daughter of nobility, possibly due to their high veil. The wearer will obtain more souls after defeating an enemy. Let's definitely wear that. Yeah, Forgot to read that. Go back. Uh, give it one more attempt. Get our souls. I mean, I'm not going to... I got to beat her. But I'm going to try to do it all in one episode.
to remember through that door. Dead. Dead. Lost all my souls. Complete. That's what you do not do, my friends. I lost over 5,000 souls there. <sighs> and that's why I said in the beginning of the level, in the last video, um, you have to watch out for the floor beneath you, and I got... Incredibly stupid and greedy just to do a run back of idiotic proportions. Now I don't care because I'm really ticked. Idiot. Well, I should have gotten... Went back to the Nexus, because Frake has awesome spells. I should have gotten those, because we already died and went back to the Nexus. Oh my goodness. I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. It's okay. Let's go this way. Well, at least we got 3,500, right? <laughs> All right. I don't think we have to kill him every single time. Wow, 
I deserve that. There they are. Fake. Real. that way. the real one. <laughs> Dead. <sighs> See how easy that is. It's nice we end on this. The gargoyles take us out. Just like in Dark Souls. <laughs> I'm thinking of doing Shrine of Storms next before Flame Lurker. come up here. And touch this stone. Get the doll demon's soul. And return to the Nexus, where you're safe and sound. And let's check out Sage Frey and see what he has to say. Get some spells. Maybe level up a little bit. I've been saving all those uh, soul items so I can... Take advantage of getting spells. So. Let's find them. Let's talk to our bro here. You saved Sage Freight, did you not? Yep. Then I was right to bend the rules and teach you a few tricks. Nevertheless, I'm grateful to you. Do you see how important selfless acts are in this dreary world? What is it? Are you still begging for magic? Ah, oh, so better than having you bother Sage Fre- <laughs> Okay, so we have to just get protection see. from him. We're done. Okay, let's find Sage Freak. Right here. Hmm. I have a proposal for you. Could you bring your demon souls to me? Of course. As That's I why determine I more about the essence of the soul. I can teach you new magic. 
A demon's soul is no mere amalgamation of lesser souls. You have your wits about you. Surely you understand me? Let's see. Uh, let's talk Do to you him. have a connection to the disciples? Do not pay attention to them if they speak poorly of me and my magic. <laughs> they do. <laughs> Prayer is for the foolish, quaint, and soon to be dead. And heaven forbid the day you find out what their so called God really is. I was defeated and captured by the Golden Elder beyond that dungeon. Beware of him, for he manipulates souls. He has power over dark souls, those susceptible to madness and paranoia. Interesting. I know of three human leaders who became demons. King Alant of Boletaria, see. Astraea of the Valley of Defilement, Astraea. and the Golden Elder of Latria. Yep, all they became have demons, proven see. that humans can evolve to a higher state he, big lore. We were wrong to right assume here. that only demons could do demon work. He has power over dark souls. We were wrong to assume. Okay. Learn spell. Okay. So. Get fire spray from hard demon soul. Warding from iron soul. Iron demon soul. And soul ray. Soul ray's amazing. We're going to get that. And they don't cost anything. Greatly reduces damage taken. We'll do that. And instead of Soul Arrow, we'll do Soul Ray. Uh, we'll keep Flame Toss and Fire Spray later. Bring me more de I patient. Let's go talk to her. He's our bro is still there. Thou seek then and um soul of the mind, key to life. Let's level up, let's see. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its I want to get these up to 18. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. And increase vitality a so bit. The world might be mended. Let's see. Probably do another two. Hmm. I do want to get them to 18, and then I could just do pump into vit intelligence. Art thou done? Main thy. I think that's gonna be it. Let's see. Let's go die before we get to forget to do that. So I'm gonna have to do that. And we'll want to upgrade maybe the mercury weapon just to keep it as another. You know, another weapon. Let's see. I don't think he'll upgrade the present falchion. I have to go to his brother. I can. Stone. Okay. Do come back alive. Hope and keep. I think that's all we'll want to. You have a heart to do pull. here. Yeah. Um, like the attire. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe on the next one. We'll continue on. I think we're going to do...
Shrine of Storms next. Well, uh, four one. Yeah, I think so. Anyway, thank you so much. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, take care. I'll see you in the next one.